All right. Yeah, I look better from a distance. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, I'm uh, Livia with uh, Meetinopolis and TV Campfire. Okay. Oh, there's my time. It's covered. Sorry. All right. My first question to you was, how was it to actually have a first episode that centered on your character and your family and your son? And um, dream come true. I remember James stuff our career said, what, what, what do you want to see happen? I said, what? You know, I'm the guy who has a family. I'm the guy who uh, has a family life at home. I, I like to see how, how that works. And so that episode appeared, and I, I was quite excited. Um, it was a very heavy episode. Um, we had a hard time watching it at our house because the park, that was the opening sequence of the show, it was the same park that basically our son grew up in. That's where all his play days were, his birthday parties. So when that park appeared, my wife just, you know, kind of came on that. Yeah, so it was, you know, I've seen the episode, it was so worst, worst pass, I had a hard time watching it, and I, and I couldn't. So, and then there was a screening uh, that Monday night at the uh, Screen Actors Guild. I, and I, I didn't watch it with the audience, but I heard it went quite well. So, I'm happy. So we can expect to maybe see some of, some of your family again? I would hope so. I, I think looking at the blogs and uh, all the Facebook stuff, there's been a lot of talks. So it's nice. It was a refreshing change. Is that what we have to look forward to um, when you guys do the spin-off of Major Crimes? We'll get to see more of everyone's characters. Going to be, I heard it's going to be more of an ensemble. I would hope so. I would hope so. Yeah, it will. It will. You know, it's not what I got. So, where your character is now, is there any kind of closure with Brenda's character or where you are right now that you would like to see happen? Other than what you um, Good question. Uh, yeah, I, I still don't know how to deal with that. I, how's, how's that working as far as the tension between the characters with the lawsuit and like they had the last episode where Gabriel didn't get. You know, subpoenaed, and how's it working with all the character interactions? And um, it's getting tense. So thank you for doing your homework and watching. I oh, I've been watching that. since episode one. I appreciate yeah. that. So, uh, you really enjoy it? I mean, is there anything, I guess, that you can tell us about where that tension is going? Can you give us any hints? These kind of the 100th episode party that's coming up. Publicity trips that you go on. Well, it, it shows her care for her group. Of, you know, gift suites. It shows her uh, <laughs> poker tournaments. And, you know, all that stuff. It's wonderful. Yeah. Yeah. It, it just really shows how much she cares about who she's taking care of. Well, I mean, yeah. She cares about us, we care about her. Like watch the pilot. Is there any character that you we have, or any other, other character on the show, that you'd like to have a scene with that you haven't had a scene with? It's definitely a winner. Uh, seven year winner, nobody knows. But, you know, it's definitely not a good question. So I would like <laughs> to have a. a, a so, um, I. Uh, I'm kind I'm of really an off, of part of it. off, off. And I think it's a wonderful scene with, uh, with and, Brenda. Uh, seven years okay. is great, you know. It's great. I mean, where that would go. They said they were going to do the show, like, you know, try to go for it. Tell somebody else I, I, I approved that choice. Okay. I'd like to see that too. Because I think from, from the beginning, I think you sensed yeah, I mean, the joke was that uh, we had met perhaps at a bit cross paths and spelling me. <laughs> you know, it's children. Right. So there's always that kind of chemistry going on. So, are you actually a techie or no? No. All right. All right. Thank you very much. I really appreciate your time. I don't want to know much beyond the episode that we're in.